Sometimes when you enter an equation or a system of equations into y equals, nothing comes up on the graph. There are several steps of troubleshooting you can take to be able to see your graph. The first and easiest fix is to learn how to use the zoom button. First, we're going to set the window back to standard view so that we're all starting in the same place. Press the zoom button and look at the options. Option six says Z standard. Scroll down to six and press the enter button. Notice that there's nothing on the graph. It's blank because there's no equations in the y equals. Now that we're all in standard view, let's enter two equations. We enter equations using the y equals button. Press y equals key and enter the two equations. y equals 2x plus 22, then scroll down to the next y equals and enter negative 0.5x plus 30. Press the graph button. Only a small portion of one line comes up on your window. It doesn't mean there's no graph, it just means you cannot see it in the current view. So we need to work with a view using the zoom button. Press zoom to see your list. Then scroll down to see numbers 8, 9, and 0. Options 9 and 0, zoom stat and zoom fit, are good buttons to experiment with when you're working with your zoom view. So go ahead and press 0, zoom fit, and that will redraw the graph, bringing up the two lines and showing the intersection. Maybe though you would like to zoom out a little in order to see the X and Y axis. Press the zoom button again and select zoom out option three. When the screen comes up and the X and Y values are suggested, press enter and it will redraw the graph further out. Some of this process is just experimentation. If you can get part of the picture on your screen with Zoom Fit or Zoom Stat, then you can refine with Zoom In or Zoom Out. So looking at our window now, we can see what we want. There is another way to have worked this out. I want to show it to you so you can start to understand that the Zoom keys are a bit of trial and error. So press the Zoom and select Standard so that we can reset the window and start the process over. Now press the Zoom key and select option 3, Zoom Out. Press Enter to select the X and Y value that was suggested on the screen and it will re-graph the two lines. Notice that this time the graph is at a closer view. This is because we zoomed out from a different starting point. The video about using the window key explains how you can control the window view manually to get exactly the screen area you desire. Combining the zoom key and the window key can help you in almost every graph situation.